because I've lived so many other places and people ask me where I'm originally from, I say Detroit, and people usually go, oh, I'm sorry. I'm not sorry that I'm from Detroit. I think it's a great city, and I think it has potential to be a, a good city, that, a better city than it is already. You know, I think that if we bring attention to Detroit, but in a positive light, more people want to be here and be here for, I don't know, the artist revolution of Detroit, possibly. <laughs> My family, my culture, my background, my community. Uh, I'm Irish. I'm an Irish American citizen. I think that's very much influenced my style. The Celts are storytellers. I'm a storyteller, so I feel like their fairy tales have inspired um, my own stories. Uh, things that have happened to my family have definitely inspired my own stories. Um, Things that have happened in this community have inspired my own stories, but also um, Detroit. I feel like I've lived a couple different places now, and but I always I always feel like I bring a piece of Detroit with me wherever I go and whatever I'm creating wherever I am. Detroit has this very this edginess to it, but it is a resilient city. So I think I like to incorporate that into my work as well. Art brings people together because it's different people from every walk of life. Dark, light, tall, short, fat, skinny. Everybody comes together and they enjoy the one thing that they love the most. I like to explore the relationships with people, but also uh, how complex people can be. People aren't just black and white. There's a million shades of color between black and white, and so many people fall under so many different color spectrums. It's not just, you know, one solid color. Graffiti is one of my favorite arts. I, I just love how I look. And like um, a while back, I recorded a dance in front of like a big uh, graffiti, um, just like, what's the name of it? It was a lot of graffiti. I just danced in front of it. And to me, that added an effect that most places don't have, but Detroit is lucky to have. Detroit is different than every place in the country. Like, Detroit has their own style. So everything in Detroit is different than everywhere else. I believe society does need art to survive because it lets everybody's individuality be expressed. And it doesn't let everybody stay like the same and be uniform. It lets everybody express who they are. Like, if you go downtown right now, it's probably somebody sitting on a corner with, you know, those big buckets with some sticks and they're making their own drums. If you really want something, you'd go after it and make sure you do everything you can to get it. I want to bring peace because to me, dancing is one of the things that can bring a crowd together. That can, it can do a lot of things that people don't understand. And like, it can bring shy people out the shadows. Um, with my art, I hope to bring people together. Like. When I go to parties, when I go to school, if there's music playing, I'm gonna start dancing. And everybody gets around me and starts recording, and they're like, hey, they hype me up. And I really just wanna bring everybody together that enjoys dancing or that enjoys watching people dance because when that energy, that positive energy is around me, I just feel happy and I enjoy it.
Art is flavorful. Art is individuality. Art is freedom. <laughs>